guys, we're back here with Kirk from Aero Precision at SHOT Show 2024 at Industry Day at the Range. We're talking about a brand new rimfire can from Aero Precision. What do we got here, Kirk? This is the Tefra 22. It's small but mighty. Uh, we had the Lahar 30 come out. It was very successful. Um, we're leveraging, you know, that internal manufacturing capability. Right. Expanding on that, you know, next logical step is to do a rimfire. So this is the Tefra. It's an aluminum 17.4 hybrid construction. So all the baffles and everything are... Okay. 17.4, so you can use an ultrasonic, clean them all that jazz. Serialized part is 17.4, and then this kind of sleeve here is going to be aluminum. What we uh, rate it for is that it's up to 5.7. You know, it's very quiet. It's easy to clean. Okay. Those are kind of the three boxes, you know, anyone's looking for a rim fire. You want yeah. to check those. So, and this is, this is our kind so of is that 5.7 semi? Uh, five seven semi full ish. We're still like, we're still if, testing. If you mag dumped an entire, yeah, yeah. okay, you'd be fine. It's seventeen right. four. It's a durable can. We've done some pretty horrible things to it that I won't say on camera, but it, gotcha. Uh, it, it, it works. <laughs> so like this two tone version here, is that going to be like your first uh, first style, or is it going to be all black? Uh, we'll have an all black one. This is Kodiak brown because it sleeves aluminum. We can anodize it, so yeah. and then we'll have an OD green as well. So. Okay, and then I know everyone's asking oh, what the what the heck is fucking Tefra. Tefra. Um, so we have the Lahar. That's like a volcanic slide with all the snow melts. Really horrible. Uh, Tefra is like small volcanic particulate. Um, it's a small can. Kind of okay. Very appropriately one. named Appropriate. for both the smaller size of the can and then of course you know air position right up there next to Rainier, the yep. gigantic mountain that's ready to blow all of Washington. Yeah, yeah. You know, <laughs> one day it will. Not today. Not tomorrow. But maybe soon. Maybe not. Well, no, we need you guys around. Yeah, no, we'll be around. We'll be around. We're, we're, we have volcano insurance. So. There we go. Oh, there we go. That's perfect. <laughs> Compared to the Lahar, this is obviously a lot smaller because it's for rim fire. But what what, what are we talking about in terms of weight and uh, length? Um, that's a really good question. I don't have the exact answers to off the top of my head. My brain's a little shot showed out right now. G give um, me, uh, like, we're Americans, so we don't have yeah. to use pounds or, or yeah, ounces yeah. or anything. Like, like do, how many badgers does it weigh or, like, squirrel Yeah, if, I, if or something? I had to do, like, so, like, length, I can answer pretty easily. It's about five inches long, about an inch in diameter. Ah, perfect. That, yeah. that was, I, that that's what I would have guessed, too. So, uh, weight, it's about half a can of mug root beer, I would say. Okay. Well, we got to go get one of those. Well, we'll do a weight comparison. See <laughs> under yeah, the, the aluminum pulls some of the weight out. Again, I'm, I apologize. don't have the exact weight metric off the top of my head. Look at so, Kirk, when can I pick up the Tefra, and how much is it going to cost me, roughly? Um, so, we're looking to launch it Q2, Q3-ish. Okay. Um, target price on it right now that we're projecting is about 370 ish So, okay. uh, it'll be right not, in there. Not bad. Pretty aggressively priced for uh, a hybrid uh, construction can. Yeah, and again, we're just leveraging that you know that internal manufacturing capability. It really helps us you know, pass that value on to the, to the customer. That's right, because you guys have uh, the two, uh, what is it, three locations now. Um, two. Two. So, most of it's under one roof. All the manufacturing is done in Lakewood. Okay. So, um, do it all in Lakewood, and then we have a, that corporate office on Tacoma. Um, kind of the, the remnants of the Tacoma. Yeah, okay. like a, so. kind of on your way out of there. Yeah, yeah, on your way out of there. So, yep, yeah, all, all in house, and you know we're we're tooling away on them as we speak. So, hell yes, I'm excited for it. I'm sure all the Rimfire fans out there are excited for it. Or maybe they don't shoot Rimfire. You can shoot five set out of this fucking thing. So, like, why yeah, not? Yeah, all, all day, all day. <laughs> Cool. Well, we've got more coming from Air Precision at Chacho 2024, but you might have to wait for some of that. We'll probably hook up with Kirk again on the showroom floor. Yep, absolutely. Right. So, guys, stay tuned to TFP TV and TFP TV Showtime for more from Chacho 2024.